Hey everybody, it's your friend Starmite here, and we're back with Dave, ready to do some more diving. Thanks for coming and hanging out with me. I hope everyone's fantastic and amazing day today. So we are working on finding some rope and scrap iron. So we found it in the last episode, but we didn't make it back to the surface in time. So we gotta find it again. And then we are also looking for some sea people artifacts. So a couple of objectives while we're under the ocean looking for things. We also got the Eye Diver app last uh, last episode. And um, I would like to focus on some air tank action. We need 65 coins. We're a little bit short. So uh, we'll also be working on that as well. So let's go ahead. We'll do a little bit diving with Dave here. We'll see what we can pull up. All right, here we are back in the water. Let's find this iron and this rope. So before it was kind of over in this direction. I'm pretty sure the oh, there's the rope. Perfect. That was easy. Pretty sure the train changes in each uh, dive here. It definitely does because that's what they said. So it's going to be a little bit tricky to keep track of all of our things here. Too busy talking, can't hit these fish. Not that I can hit the fish anyways, but uh, so yeah, we want to keep an eye on our O2 meter. I want to get a little bit more fish for our uh, sushi area. We got to find that scrap iron as well. Okay. Let's see what we got going on down in this area. Got another plank. We'll grab that guy. Here's another one. Okay, let's watch our tank here. 60. It seems to be lasting much longer than before. So we did get that upgrade. I think I wanted to say it was the 80 meters. So um, maybe the, the depth matters for um, how much oxygen? Maybe? I don't know. That doesn't make sense, but... Got it. Apparently you just spam that till you get to the green. Look at this big old thing. Yeah, I'm getting distracted here. Okay, so what do we got? We got a radio call. A skate pod. Oh, right on. So we saw mention of the skate pod, but I wasn't sure what it was. What? See if can be picked up with these gloves. Okay, we'll just leave it. Escape pod. Let's see what that says. Use the escape pod to escape to your boat as quickly as possible. Check your surroundings first as the calling process takes some time. Okay, so we... That's great to know. We do have a little bit of time, but I want to keep looking just a little bit more. We got some squid boys over here. It's kind of cool. Okay, so we might need a better harpoon because we just can't pull those guys in. The little guy we better be able to get. Okay, well. Yeah, let's go ahead. We'll head back up in this area. And let's skate pod. Ah! Okay, we're just going to go straight, straight up. We got plenty of time. And that fish is not great. Man. Yeah, it's like as soon as you get hit, you uh, you lose your O2 very, very quickly. And we'll be able to make it, I think, this time. Okay. I think you've actually managed to bring it back. I expect you to quietly expire in the depths. Wow. Seems I've underestimated you very well. I'll show you how to make the basic underwater rifle with these materials. First of all, Download Duff's Weapon Shop on your phone. All right, get that. Craft it up. Collected all the materials. Good. Let's try to create a new weapon. <laughs> That's fantastic. Basic underwater rifle. All right, equip the weapon right away. Okay. With a neat explanation like that, even someone like you should have understood. I guess. Oh, one more thing. I've taken some measures to allow you to open weapon chests underwater. Weapon chests. You can't bring them out of the sea, but they can be handy. Hmm. I'll collect info about the weapons you pick up and create blueprints. Weapons made with a blueprint won't break down underwater. In any case, this master will be watching you. All right, we got the uh, weapon, the gun weapon. <laughs> nice. Craft weapons at Duff's weapon shop. Oh, I'm wondering if that's what perhaps some of this wood is going to be used for. Ingredients collected. We got a couple of uh, blue tang and a yellow back guy. Oh. And our sushi buddies had about it. Dave, while you were out at sea, the repairs were completed. Oh. Let's head to the restaurant. Mm. Looking very nice. Oh doesn't matter how delicious the food is, the restaurant can't be a mess. If you want to change the interior, the interior menu below is open. Please check it out. Oh, that's cool. 
Really change the interior of Bancho Sushi. Use the interior tab to select a style to your liking. But, as Dr. Bacon said, if the remains of sea people are found here, and customers will indeed come. But this area is kind of remote, so I think I will need a way to advertise this store until then. These days it's just about impossible to attract customers without publicity. Have you tried the social media app called Cooksta? The social media app young people use to post pictures of food they eat? <laughs> Yeah, that's how all businesses are promoting themselves lately. I simply can't understand why people would waste their time like that. Sushi makes an impression on the heart, not photographed. Even so, isn't it better to use it than to keep people ignorant of your food? You have a point there. Making an account is simple, let's try it out. We first register and make the hashtag Mancho Sushi, then done. It's not as complicated as I expected. Now customers happy with your food will follow Mancho Sushi. I'm not sure about this, but okay. I'll also install the Cooksta app on my phone and check the followers' posts. Okay. Raise your rating with Cooksta. More customers will visit and new foods will be unlocked. The unlocked conditions of new ratings can be seen in the Cooksta app. Okay. Let's well let's check out the interior while we're here. I do like this. It's the uh, theme we got going on here. But let's just see what else we have. Ooh. Okay, so here we got the um, nice wood here, the tables. I like this uh, oriental modern theme. That looks good. Let's see what two looks like. Got our brown stools. So yeah, we need, of course, coins for all of these things. All sorts of neat things around here. Okay, um, let's go for. Can I put that up? Oh, heck yeah! I love it. Great. Okay, so let's go left control apply, and we'll do that. All right, let's go ahead and we'll set up our menu. Um, we got a couple more blue. Ooh, we can enhance the blue tang. Okay, let's check that out. The blue tang can be leveled up. Ingredients used for enhancement will disappear. Let's go ahead and enhance that. has been completed all right we'll go ahead okay let's see can we enhance this even further so it looks like we need three more of those guys all right we really need to get some fish going on here we don't have anything for the evening so let's get some harpooning going we do have that gun now we have to check that out but we really need to get some fishing done here oh a dolphin what's up buddy Wants me to follow it? Mayhem? Seems to be asking me to follow. Should I try and ask? Alright. A dolphin's request. Okay, let's um let's go, I guess. So tab here, it's gonna cycle between our pistol and the harpoon we have. And I guess I have to deal well, I wonder if I can ignore this buddy for just a minute. I want some of these guys. Looks like you can, good. Okay, so the dolphin's waiting for me, waiting for me. Oh, weapon's chest. Oh man, I'm getting nervous a little bit about our, um, a pink dolphin caught in a net. It was asking me to rescue its friend. I should cut that net. Okay, we've got 50 seconds left. Oh, it's space bar. Okay, we do have an evac over here, great. Nice. Ooh, it dropped a shiny. Okay, let's see what it is. I didn't even know dolphins had mates. <laughs> Mission completed. All right, let's see what it is. A pearl. Great. All right, let's get some of these iron things. Get iron. We have 44 left. Let's open this thing up. Uh, a poison harpoon. Okay. We gotta get some of these fish, like I mentioned. <laughs> I wasn't expecting a dolphin, though. I feel like uh, a poison harpoon. Oh boy. 
I feel like a poison harpoon is not a great idea for uh, fish that you're eating. Just a, just a thought. That's, that's weird. It, I guess it adds that uh, the damage over time effect there. Okay, we got 32 still. Ooh. Okay, we got the dot on him. Get this guy too. That should do some good work for us. All right. I'm gonna die again, aren't I? How did the, the oxygen is weird? It's not as consistent as I think it would should be. All right, let's get out of here. Back to the surface. Okay, we all, we got a couple good things in that run. Long fin batfish and uh, some red tooth tigerfish. Okay, to the fish tank. It's already mm -hmm. evening. I feel stiff. Even so, Boncho's working alone. I should probably help. It's not easy to manage with two people with more customers coming in. Not enough workers. Okay, wrap up your day and get things ready at the sushi store. Okay. Oh, looks like we got a critic tonight. What I do? This is a Bancho Sushi place, huh? Miss Yoshi. I came by because I heard this place is getting popular on Cooked Stuff. The name gave me pause, but to think it's really your place. New food using never before seen ingredients. Can't taste this anywhere else. Attack a turn, but masculine chef. Do they mention me too? No, not really. <laughs> In any case, what brings you all the way here, Miss Yoshi? Oh, various reasons. I wanted to check out the restaurant. Looks like you're still the same. Well, there is nothing to change. I simply continue on day by day, training myself. My goodness, that is a problem. You refused to listen to me last time in a similar fashion, and that's what got you booted from the hotel. You're talking about that again. That's the customer's fault for judging the food without even trying it. How long will you continue treating customers that way? To keep making that terrible food. What do you mean, terrible? Whole roasted shark head is an excellent dish. Shark has used in cuisine in both the West and the East. And in Korea, it was even used in ancestral rituals. Stop, you've never changed one bit. Let me judge for myself then, whether it's food bit or consumption. Then I can tell you why I came. Fine then, I'll show you. I'll make sure you know the true taste of shark head meat. Ancho, isn't this development a bit sudden? Babe, as a chef, this is a fight I can't back out of. My pride hangs in the balance. Please give me a white tip reef shark head and olive oil. You want me to catch a white tip reef shark? Yes, with your skills, it should be easy enough to do. But a harpoon's not likely to be enough. Take a good gun with you into battle. Even so, fighting a shark sounds way too dangerous. Do you mean to say you'll just stand by and watch while my pride is trampled? The white tip reef shark is usually found in the ocean far to the right. Good luck. He suddenly wants me to get him a shark head. This is preposterous, and it can only be killed with a gun? We'll have to ask Duff to make me a gun, or search for one in the blue hole. Alright. We got a special customer tonight. Sometimes special customers with a backstory will hear of the sushi bar and visit. Learn dishes that the customers want through research and serve them to the customers. Alright, we're still unlocking tons of stuff. Research new recipes. Use the Artisan's Flame to expand your menu. Okay, so now we know what Artisan's Flames are for. Um, we didn't get any blue tang. Let's, oh yeah, let's enhance this guy. Because we got the ability to. Um, or actually, we want, I kind of want quantity right now, right? Let's, let's just wait a little bit. We'll put that guy on there. We'll grab this guy and go ahead and open her up. Uh oh. <laughs> oh, okay. Here we go. Whole, whole roasted shark head. Um, Arsene's name will be used. That's great. Ooh. Right, we got it. Okay. Mm -hmm. I wonder if she's gonna sit around for a minute. Mm -hmm. okay, 
Nice. So, so that was a four count. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Perfect. Nice. Okay, so we got that figured out at least. We got a we got a thing on Cooksta there. Dirty dish to clean up. We'll get that mopped up here. That's Bancho Sushi Bar for you. Amazing. Nice. That's a good review. So we got this isn't bad, is it? Hmm. Got a we got a thumbs up for that one. And that's the evening. Close for the day. Okay, so on Cooksta we got our coal rank up a little bit, five out of ten. Uh, we had our top sale of our Fusler sushi, and today was the best. Net profit of fifty-four. All right. All right, looks like it's raining out. Okay, so we still need the shark head and we still need to find the sea people. Uh, we got a couple new posts. Uh, I'm not gonna bother with those. We're gonna go back into the water, do some dive. Should figure out how to use our, uh, our, our gun too. Looks like it's the same kind of control. I wonder, I wonder. Okay, we can use it for that. Interesting. Um, does this say shock harpoon? Sure. That's probably better than the poison one. Man. I'm wondering if that might. I wonder if that's easier. Maybe easier for me since I'm so bad at this. Level. Well, maybe not. <laughs> okay. angle wasn't quite right. Let's see if we can get this guy. Okay. It's hard to tell, it's hard for me to tell which fish are applicable to, uh, to gather here. What do we have now? Shock Harpoon 2. Okay. There's a deal in there. Got another oxygen. Yeah, let's pick that up. Oh, that refilled us. Nice. Okay. So he said go all the way to the right. Uh, to forget that that shark. So that's what we're gonna do. Chalk bang stick. Okay. Let's get that iron as well. Okay. We know we can get the tang, but I don't think I can get any. Okay. I can get these buddies. That's, okay. That's the cardinal fish. And we got a fish, uh, an oxygen tank right here. It's great. So what happens if we blast this? Okay. You're gonna be like that. Let's try the shark or uh, shock harpoon. Oh, lionfish! Ah! Uh... Uh, come on! I'm not gonna be able to get that guy because I can't get away from these things. Okay, we're 39. Ooh. No! Okay, Titan Target. We gotta get out. Oh, man. Come on, come on, come on. Mm, come on, Dave! We gotta get to the top! Oh! This is gonna be really close. Oh, man. That was really close. Oh man. Biggest fish, green hump 
head parrot fish. All right. And we got a Titan Terror fish. Screw those things. Those guys are scary with the. They got teeth or something? No bueno. All right. Okay. <laughs> he looks like Ash Ketchum. Do you know a lot about this giant blue mm. hole? I'm not sure what to say. It's different in there every time. Yes, that's it. It's the best place to collect Marinka. I could complete my collection in this place. Mar Marinka? Don't tell me you don't know the highly popular Ocean Life trading cards, Marinka. How can you not have heard of the futuristic trading cards that utilize an AI recognition system that automatically corresponds to fish in real life? Never heard of them. Sounds fun, though. You seem quite behind the times. Let me help you install the app. So you do this, then press here, touch that, add a friend, done. Hmm. Okay, so what do I do now? The amazing thing about these Marinka is you don't really need to do anything special. Just catch a few, few fish and you'll get a card. Check the cards every now and then on the app and you're done. I see. I guess I'll be able to easily see what fish I've caught so far. That's right. It's almost like a... Whoa. You don't want to be saying that name. I understand. I'll try it out. I forgot to introduce myself, didn't I? I'm Sato. I'll give you my contact info, so hit me up if you have questions. See you later. <laughs> nice little nod there. I like that. Catching fish will allow you to automatically acquire cards. You get fancier cards for catching higher grade fish. Okay, so it's afternoon time, so we're ready to go back to the water. Let's go ahead and do that. All right, let's see if we can get some more of these bigger uh, fish that we got down here. Now that we have that uh, gun, this gun thing, got a couple of blue tangs. Let's see if we can get these guys. Yeah, I'm just not getting the hang of the harpoon yet. It's just not very intuitive for me. Let's... Okay, nope. But we got that one, finally. Let's... Maybe I'm just gonna switch to the gun here. It seems very excessive. But I can't aim with that either. It does have a little bit of better range, it seems like, though. Okay, we got some... Ooh, got some bolts down here. Got that. It's much easier for me to use the gun. <laughs> it's not as cool, but uh, it's way easier. All right, what else we got here? 49 on our oxygen meter. Got to watch out for this Mori eel here. Can we do anything to it? Got to be able to hit it first, of course. Nope. Okay. Let's see what we can get out of this. Triple axle. Uh, picking up a new weapon allows you to collect the blueprints. Okay, great. A triple axle. This wild horse can finish enemies with just three bullets at close range. Huh. Alright. Cool. Uh, yeah, let's go ahead and grab this O2. 37 to 90. I love it. What's this little guy right here? Oh, oh that's a batfish. Okay. Okay, and here's one of these big boys again. Ah. I wasn't expecting it to be a spray like that. Oh, but nice. Oh, and there's another one right here. We gotta watch out for that other guy down here, because he's gonna be a jerk. Um... I should hit some more bullets. Oh, Dave, what a guy. If you exceed your weight limit, you will slow down. Okay, well, we must be heavy. Yes, we are. All right. Well, we have the escape pod right here, which would be great. Let's just um, try a little bit longer here. I want to see if I can get this guy. Oh, I'm not fast enough. Alright. 
We should probably get out of here before it's too late. I'm pushing my limit. Yep, and then we got some lionfish coming in. Let's get out of here. Get that escape pod. These are nice to find. It looks like I'm not losing my O2 when I'm interacting with that, which is great. All right, back up top. 50% on our triple axe. Oh, all right. We got our tiger fish, and we got a couple of their uh, junk. But look at all the other fish we got. It's going to be a great night at the sushi place. Grab up your day and get things ready. All right, well, let's go ahead and go back inside. All right. So for ingredients, we have a couple new boys. We got the uh, tiger fish here, the parrot fish, and then the bat. Uh, so we can sell these, which is, that could, that could be good. Does it tell me anything here? Um, no, I don't see anything that's specifically telling me how much um, we get for selling those guys. So let's go ahead and uh, get our menu set up here. Oh, look at all these goodies. Yeah, let's we'll upgrade that, sure. We got the upgrade, excellent. Okay, let's see. Should just upgrade this too while we're at it nice okay what is this one cardinal fish oh yeah we gotta upgrade that one for sure great and then blue tang we sell a lot of blue tang let's upgrade this guy all right these are gonna be great okay uh let's go over that guy little bat fish on there uh we have three of these cardinal fish new upgraded let's, let's get those guys going Two of these, all right. And then we have two of these guys. Okay, we're good to go. Let's open her up. Let's see what we, what we can do. Be cool if we could get to um, the 10 likes there in the top left. We have the uh, five out of 10. Okay, so she's back looking for that shark head and we don't have it yet. And this person wants some tea. Perfect, nice. Okay. Nice, got another blue one. Okay, those guys are taken care of. Okay. We got one more thumbs up. Four more. Three more. Oh yeah. Let's get this cleaned up. Okay. We got a lot of coins. We need one more. If, if this guy gives us a thumbs up, we have our 10 out of 10. There it is. Bronze acquired. All right. New recipes added. Yellow back. And then we got some salt red. Red to tiger fish. All sorts of good stuff. Menu slot. Nice. Oh, kitchen staff. A little bit more wasabi. I haven't done anything with, with wasabi, but I saw it sitting over in here. You won't be able to produce food if you run out of wasabi. Grind and refill the wasabi before it runs out. Oh. Um. Oh! I was. I, I didn't see that. I was looking over in the corner and I was like, what's going on here? Okay. We got enough, I guess. Nice. Even though we were a little late, we still got the thumbs up on that one. crushed it for today look at that five artists and flames looking good and that's gonna be the beginning of day five for us so we did get to the next level it's gonna let us add another a menu item to our sushi bar but that's gonna be it for this episode for today thanks for coming and hanging out with me i hope you enjoyed this one have a fantastic and amazing rest of your evening day or night and i'll talk to you again soon